Now my high school years would not be complete unless I mentioned some of the guys from church and seminary who I didn't necessarily have a crush on, but definitely had a huge impact on my life. Now, a lot of these guys had like being nice, being funny. Um, a lot of them could sing or dance and I love that. I love when people embrace the talent um, and work at it. And I've always had this dream of like dancing in the living room and um, singing at the top of our lungs in the car. Like those are some dreams of mine. And so obviously I found that um, really attractive. Um, others were people who would serve on um, student government at their respective schools and me being someone who is absolutely lo obsessed with leadership, um, I obviously loved that um, because student government was such a huge part of my life during that time and I loved that we could relate on that. Um, there was this one dude in particular who would push me out of my comfort zone in a good way um, and I feel like I really desperately needed something and if we're being honest I still need people like that in my life to this day um, but I attribute this person to one of the reasons why I'm here in Nashville right now is because that person was like Hannah you have an opportunity to go out there explore embrace the music um, and really live your life for a moment and I think you should go and it is because of the, that person that I felt like I could do this, that I could move across the country. And for that, I am forever grateful. Because it's one thing when um, your family and close friends say that, but it's another thing when someone who you trust but don't necessarily know the greatest says the same thing. And for that, I will forever be indebted to this person. So to all the guys that I liked in my high school years from church and seminary, you don't necessarily know that I had a crush on you, if you can call it a crush, but I want to thank you for the impact that you've had on my life and I sincerely wish you guys the best.